Guys, we finally did it. We finally freaking did it. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So this is my baby. This is my baby, 2002 RAV4. I really like the rims on it. They're stock, but they look really nice. I really like them a lot. It has a little boo-boos here and there, of course, but that's the whole point of getting a new car, a new old car that you really want. So I really wanted a RAV4, so this was the car that I got, you know? So already I see some things. I see that it's kind of leaning down more on the driver's side. So we definitely got to change the struts. See, the tires need air. The paint's a little chip, but it's a it's a nice green. It's like a nice winter green. I'm going to probably do a paint job over it just to really hook her up, you know? Yeah. But here she is. Here she is. So I love Rav Force because of a hatchback. So we got this right here. Got a lot of space. What I like too is that these seats are removable. We got a little outlet right here. Oh, I never opened this up. Let's see if there's anything in here. Nope. It's a little compartment. Got another compartment here. Another compartment here. Nothing. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I love this. I had a RAV4 before. My RAV4 didn't have this. Oh, wow. I didn't even know it had this. So this is for like real privacy, you know? Make sure your stuff is secure. I'm still learning how to use this thing to be honest, but it's cool. And I like this, it's like a seat belt, an extra seat belt here for the middle, or if someone wants to sit in the back, or if you want to strap something down, so it's pretty cool. Is the interior pretty clean in my opinion I think she's pretty clean you know oh okay so that that seat belt is actually for the middle seat here in case you have a, a passenger that's odd because normally the seat belt will be somewhere here but yeah so the seat belt is all the way back here that's pretty unique I never seen that before all right let's go to the driver's side So here's the driver's side. Yeah, man, brings back a lot of memories because what I used in New York was a RAV4. So this is really cool. I would have loved to have had my RAV4 out here in Puerto Rico, so now we got one. My goal really is to just hook her up she got some codes, so I'm going to try to get rid of the codes, and I just want to hook her up. I'm going to keep it general. I'm going to hook her up, and I'm going to show you guys what I do as we continue on. All right, so let's go for a little test drive. Let's start up the car. Okay. Put her in drive, and we out. So where we at? We in Puerto Rico right now. We're in Plaza Carolina, Baba. Plaza Carolina in Carolina. Um, we're in the parking lot, so we're just going for a little test drive. We're doing our thing. I'm also testing out the, the, I guess the phone mount or the camera mount that I have. It's like a dash cam mount that came with my camera. If this works out well, we're gonna start doing more videos like this now that I have my own car and drive around all the cool areas in Puerto Rico that I know and just give you guys some clean, stabilized uh, dash cam footage, basically. I also have a camera, excuse me, I also have a microphone installed into the camera. So hopefully it's blocking out a lot of road noise or anything of that sort. So we driving right now through the parking lot. Whoops, speed bump. Okay. Like I said earlier, we got to change the struts, definitely. So if you hear any clunking around, that's what that noise is. So I'm going to just, I actually got to do something in the mall, but I don't care. This is, 
think I'll have more fun doing this. So I'm gonna leave the mall real quick, just so you guys can see what this part of Puerto Rico looks like. Again, this is Carolina. Uh, we're just leaving Plaza Carolina. Now we're going over this little bridge. You don't know how amazing this feels because the sidewalk that you see to the right of me with this bus stop right here, I used to walk this all the time because from where I live, the bus would leave me all the way up the block over there, like where the, the traffic light is coming up. And in order for me to get to the mall that we were just at, I'd have to walk all of this just to get into the mall. And now here I am driving my own car down the same route that I would have to take without I would have to walk on foot, you know? So it feels really good. All right, we're coming down the avenue, going back towards Plaza Carolina. We're in Carolina. It's just a nice smooth road. I used to like driving down here when I had the rental, so it's just nice driving down here in my own car. Thank you. 